Greetings to all, I'm Brother Shmel Tozon, servant of the true God, our Creator, the living God. God marked me with fire on my belly as a proof that I am His servant. I was born to serve Him. I have a message to America, American leaders and uh, her allies. Um, um, I have a message that uh, uh, the Lord God made me to understand and to know. Um, America, you need to pull back. In Europe, you are not yet ready. The American people are not yet ready. If uh, um, God told me, um, because when I was speaking, God is uh, guiding me. So sometimes I'm going to speak, but I have to stop. God is telling me. So God is guiding me with words that I will be able to give to you the correct details. So what God said, first you need to assemble the locust. The locust that is prophesied in the Holy Bible. The locust. It's uh, God showed that to me. It's um, thousands of aircrafts some are warplanes some are some are bombers some are for transport some are for utility you need to assemble the locust tanks are already obsolete as you can see the they can uh, the low price drones the low low tech low price drones can uh, uh, remove tank from the battlefield so tanks are already obsolete the Holy Bible is right. And the tanks, they're heavy. They're hard to transport. And then when you went to the battlefield, they are almost uh, worthless because of this new uh, drone low price technology. I don't know, they call it the Lancet or something. And so tanks are already obsolete. The Holy Bible is right. Our Lord God is correct. Of course, in predicting the future, He said this 2,000 years ago. The future of warfare is the locust. Thousands of air, uh, air vehicles, warplanes, transport vehicles, utility vehicles, support vehicles, aerial. This is the future. The Lord God prophesied this in the Holy Bible. It's called the locust. It's called the locust because there are so many that they can almost darken the sky this is the future of warfare so god is telling me this god informed me this that's why i'm telling america your leaders your allies your armies do not attack it's not yet the right time you're not yet ready the the army is not yet ready we need to fix still many things to be ready so preparation preparation needs to be done first i like um, do not be intimidated intimidated with whatever happening in other parts of the world you need to strengthen your cert certain you need to strengthen your center first the, your center the mainland america as i have uh, told you so do not attack now it will be a mistake it will be a mistake so and uh, so this is the message i want you to tell you today uh if you're if you're deploying uh in other parts of the, the world just for like uh maintaining uh, security it's okay but you need uh, to make big preparation at your center. This is uh, what the Lord God told to me. And uh, God showed this to me very, very clearly. Very, very clearly. So, you have generals in your country. You have advisors. You have war experts. But, be smart at this. Because we are all, we are all human beings. We are only humans. We cannot see the future. 
Only our Lord God can say the future. Only God the Creator can tell us the future. Which part of it is already written in the Holy Bible, the summarization. So you have to listen. America, your leaders, your allies, your military leaders, you have to listen. First, we need to create the locust. Aerial superiority. Not only superiority, dominance. This is the future. This is the... This war will end. Will end all other wars. And then, our Lord Jesus Christ with God the Father and the giant spacecraft will come here on earth. There are other preparations the Lord God told to me that uh, I cannot uh, reveal right now. Maybe I can reveal it. Yeah, um, uh, no, no. God telling me not to reveal it right now, but there are some other things that the Lord God told to me that uh, must be done. But these details I will tell you when, uh, when uh, I meet you in person, your leaders. Because God is telling me that you will come. This is what the Lord God told me. You will come with some of your uh, advanced uh, advanced air vehicles, some uh, advanced helicopters and warplanes. And I, I saw I saw that. God showed that to me. And uh, some of your uh, vehicles you will come. At that at that moment, God told me many other details I cannot open here. But God told me more details about this. And so, America, I need to prepare. Don't attack now, no. Yes, uh, take care of your security of your borders, but do not attack now. You're not yet ready. I will help you to prepare. Uh, God told us what must be done. God told us the preparation that must be done. You will win. You will be the dominant power, as I was always saying. But just do not attack right now. It's not yet the right time. Okay, God is telling me to stop. Okay, this is my message for today. Greetings to all and greetings to all those who join me. And uh, our Lord God will guide us toward the future. So I am the servant of the Lord that God sent. I was born here on earth on, on this prop exact time and God marked me to to help to help you prepare about the future to fulfill the plans of God and the preparation of his coming giant spacecraft that is called in the Bible the New Jerusalem. As I'm always saying God is an alien God. The true God who created us is an alien being. This is the truth. God is telling me to stop. So, greetings to all. Glory to God, our Creator, our Father in Heaven, and glory to His Son, Lord Jesus Christ. Amen.